Defend yourself against DDoS attacks by hiding your true IP address with ExpressVPN. And visit my custom link expressvpn.com slash gillymaster in the description to find out how you can get an extra three months free. Hey everyone and welcome to another episode of the GTA Online Top 5 Community Plays. If you're new to the channel, this is a series where I take clips from you guys in the community and pick 5 of the best ones to showcase each episode. And if that interests you and you'd like to submit a clip of your own for a chance to be featured in the next one, you can find all of the instructions to do so down in the description. Kicking things off at number 5 is Patero93 in the Savage just slapping a stealth jet out of the sky. I'm assuming the jet was trying to shoot back at him, but as we all know, the tracers are bugged on the Raiju jet, so we can't see them anyways. Only when the jet actually hits shots can we tell when they are shooting at something. In this case, though, he managed to miss all of them, and at the same time, ate a line of savage cannon fire face first with the debris casually flying by. At number 4 today is Netsiu. He's trying to take out the scramjet with a stealthy RC Bandito play, but the scramjet just barely jumps away at the perfect time right before detonation. Although, that is not gonna save him. Netsuyu hits a laser beam shot on the falling scramjet with the railgun. That shot is not easy to hit on the first attempt at all. He just comes out of the RC Bandito and immediately smoked him out of the sky. And that's really what you have to do to beat a scramjet is take him out while he's recovering or falling because if you're against someone who is good in the scramjet, that's a tough situation to be in. You're probably going to get spawn trapped. In the number three spot is TLKOG with an extremely long range snipe on a buzzard pilot. This one was way, way in the distance, so far away that you can hardly even make out the shape of the vehicle. If I wasn't such a no-life at this game, I would have no idea what vehicle that was. And even how far he had to lead the target as well. Normally, you don't have to lead helicopters as much as jets, with the exception being here, extreme distances. And he went down in just a single shot. Now getting into the top two, we have some nasty plays here. First up from Angel Knight 85 an absolutely marvelous show of skill in the Deluxo. That initial spin around into the reverse flight to dodge all the rockets and counter with his own, followed by another spin while dodging more rockets, just looks so elegant. He's just gliding through the air, smoothly dodging everything that is thrown at him. And to finish off the clip, he seals the deal with the parachute kill at the very end after the guy jumps off his bike. So he blew up the bike and got the guy parachuting. Such a great play with the Deluxo. But in the number one spot, Outrageous brings that same energy in a B-11 strike force. I mean, I think that clip kind of just speaks for itself, you know? He took out a Mark II while flying backwards in a B-11 strike force. And then he does some crazy spins to dodge all the rockets at the end, which looks cool as shit. Some straight up Top Gun Maverick style rocket dodges being deployed there. That was a fantastic clip. Very well done. Anyways, that is going to wrap up this episode of the GTA Online Top 5 Community Plays. Let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite. And again, if you'd like to submit a clip of your own for a chance to be featured in the next episode, you can find all the instructions to do so down in the description. And if you enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like as well as subscribe to my channel for more GT Online content. I also want to give a huge shout out to all my channel members for your support. If you'd like to become a member for some exclusive perks, you can either use the join button or the link that's down in the description. And as always, thanks for watching and have a great day.